What's up, everyone? It's Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Louisiana versus UT Arlington college basketball matchup going down Thursday, March 3rd, 2022. But before we get to that free pick, got to let you guys know PickDogs.com. We're doing it bigger and better than anyone else. Got more free pick videos on our channel than you'll find anywhere else on YouTube, so make sure you're subscribed. And also take advantage of our free sportsbook bonus offer. The link in the description of this video below. I always say who doesn't love getting free bets and free money, and a lot of times having an extra sports book in your back pocket, the extra tool on your belt, could often make the difference between winning your bet and crumpling up the ticket and throwing it in the trash. So definitely take advantage of that offer. Like I said, the link in the description of this video below. But let's get to this one between Louisiana and UT Arlington. And you got to UT Arlington 11-17 on the year, 13 of, uh, sorry, 12-14 and 14 against the number. Meanwhile, Louisiana 13-14 and 14 straight up and 11-13 and 13 and 1 against the number this season. Now you got the 8-9 uh, matchup in the Sun Belt tournament as uh, Louisiana comes into the tournament on, uh, after having, sorry, after a, uh, Sixty-eight to sorry, sixty-five to fifty-eight road loss to Georgia State that snapped a three-game win streak at that point. Meanwhile, UT Arlington entering the tournament on a three-game losing streak after a sixty-two to fifty-two loss at the hands of South Alabama. Now you know with these conference tournament games, it can be tricky. You know, especially when you consider that UT Arlington actually beat uh, Louisiana in both meetings this season. So I may have you scratching your head, like, well, then why is Louisiana favored here? Well, like I said, sometimes with uh, with these conference tournaments, you can kind of throw head-to-head -head meetings out the window because these two teams in these smaller uh, tournaments, they're not like a, like a, like your Big Tens, your Big Twelves, or whatever, where you have a, a likely chance of potentially getting a, an at-large bid if you've done enough in the regular season. The Sun Belt's usually a one-bid league, and if these two teams lose, their season's pretty much over unless they get an invitation to one of the lesser tournaments, but... I, I don't know if we'll get that with Louisiana and UT Arlington, but uh, you know, sometimes it just boils down to the name of the game is to score more points than the other team. And the UT Arlington was definitely having some offensive issues down the stretch in their three-game losing streak to finish the year. They were averaging around 51 points a game. So it's one of those things where I just don't know if UT Arlington is going to be able to keep up with Louisiana, who you know were averaging around 71 points per game this season. And uh, in conference, well, weren't too shabby either. Literally that identical 71.1 point per game mark. And uh, I just, like I said, three points. <sighs> it's it's a tough game, not a game I'm rushing to the window to bet. There is It is early action, though. It's early afternoon college hoops, and that's what we want. So I'm going to lean towards Louisiana here, lay in the bucket. And like I said, not my strongest play on the board, but I do lean towards the Cajuns here, and that's going to be my free pick. But if you're looking for best bets for myself or any of our other world-class handicappers, check out Pick Dogs Premium. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and drop a like. Let's cash some winners.